everybody, it's June here. Um, again, excuse, uh, excuse the mess here. I'm just trying to get myself straightened up here um, because I want to show you something um, that arrived just today. This package I have not opened yet, so I want to open it in front of you and show you something really cool. Anyway, uh, here we go. So I'm just going to open this up. Not going to take my coat off or anything like that. Let's just Dispense with the niceties and open the parcel. Um, okay, so inside this envelope is another envelope. You can tell I'm a little bit excited. Um, oh, goodness. I'm just going to tear this thing open here. <laughs> Scissors would have been good. How are you all, by the way? I hope you're all well. We are freezing cold here at the moment, um, but I haven't been snowed on yet, which is amazing. I live right beside the sea, so it's a little bit warmer where I live. Um, the mountains near me are covered in snow, and I, can, I was looking at that today. Now, there you go. This is the package, and it's got the magic word on it. Hakuhodo. So yes, you can guess now. You know now what I've got here. This is an amazing package from Hakuhodo. Um, this was one of my kind of New Year's resolutions was um, reduced uh, and very targeted spending <laughs> for the year. And this is the first, my first sort of spend, if you like. So the packaging comes off. That's kind of a paper packaging and it's that lovely orangey red, that Japanese red, if you like. Now, Hakuhodo box. This is really cool. So opens up to reveal this little leaflet, how to care for your brushes. And more packaging, all wrapped very nicely. And inside there are lots of amazing brushes. How cool is that? Um, Okay, so we've got the H2944, which is like a blending brush. I will definitely show you these out of their packages when I get time. There is the H2945, which is this smaller blending brush. Um, there is the H3003, which is a bigger, um, more uh, round-topped, domed kind of blending brush, a round one. This one here is um, slightly smaller than this. Um, you have the H2986, which is a flat shading brush. You have the H2901, which is a pointed crease brush. There is the H3004, which I'm sorry, I'm actually going to take this one out because I'm really curious about this. I remember one time ordering um, a Mac 239 on eBay. And it was actually a real Mac 239, um, <laughs> surprisingly. But uh, when I got it, I opened the package and in my haste, I cut the top off the package and I cut the top off the brush as well. So a bit careful now. Uh, yeah, this is the, this is the H23, H3004, which is like a highlighting brush. It's a nice, um, oh my God, that is so soft. It's like a highlighting brush or contouring brush. It's goat hair and I can tell you now guys, it's the softest thing I've ever felt in my life. There you go. Um, there is the H3740, which is this one, which is, um, honest to God, scissors would really be useful for me. Did I tell you I went to college? Um, now, yes, this one is sort of like a 
a highlighting blush, brush or a blending brush. H3740 and it's this one here which is sort of like a, a blending brush or highlighting brush. I'm going to try and keep these together so I know which is which. And then this one here, the last one, is the H3739. And this one again is um, a face brush. And it's like a MAC 109, except a MAC 109 from heaven. Um, this is like, I'm sure, what angels use to put their makeup on. Um, this is just incredible. The, the, the softness of these, um, I just don't want to lose track of the numbers. The softness of these brushes is indescribable. They are unreal. So yeah, so that's my Hakuhodo haul. Um, I will use these brushes and I am going to tell you all about them, tell you what I think. And um, you know, I am going to love these, I'm sorry, I can tell you that in advance. Um, they are soft, they are beautiful, they are so different, they are amazing. Um, so I just wanted to show you that because I'm super excited, as you can imagine. Um, and I think I'm going to be just falling in love with these new brushes. So I will definitely do a video on them to tell you more about, uh, about the brushes and what I think of them. And um, I'll show them to you in more detail in another video, if, you, if you'd like, um, when I get a chance to take them all out and uh, play with them all. So um, that's really all. I will probably this week do a video on the Burberry eyeshadows, um, the complete eye palettes. I've got those, so I will do a video on those. If you're interested, just leave a comment below if that's what you want to see. Um, next, there is also um, a sort of supplemental haul that I want to do because um, after I did my haul video last week, I realised that I had actually received a very nice gift from um, from uh, my friend Deb, whose channel I will link below, and she sent me some very nice things at Christmas time, and um, I'd forgotten to show them to you because they really were um, they really were terrific. She sent me a couple of brushes that I really like. And some eyeshadows that are really, really beautiful as well. So um, there's that and um, another few bits and pieces that I'd actually picked up, uh, which I forgot to show you, just drugstore things. So that's really all, guys. Um, cool brushes. Very, very beautiful brushes. I am in brush heaven. And um, so, yay. My next job is to acquire a couple more Burberry blushes I think and then I do want to look into getting the Billy B brushes as well um, but I have to think about that and that's going to be something I'll do maybe in the next month or two because I'm not just going to go on a major spending um, sort of free for all not at the moment so that's it guys I hope you enjoyed that little sort of teaser about brushes <laughs> and um, I will talk to you all again very soon. So take care. Bye bye.